Hello, good morning everyone. So today I would like to present to you the solutions and products which Infineon has to offer for onboard charger and auxiliary applications. So what is an onboard charger? So onboard charger is that piece of equipment which you find in an electric car which enables you to charge the high voltage battery from an uh, electricity grid. So today we see different kind of solutions in the market. It could be single phase, multi, three phase, bi-directional, unidirectional. Also we see different topologies. It could be a totem pole uh, power factor correction circuit or a uh, uh, classical boost topology or a Vienna topology. So the bottom line is that uh, one solution may not fit all customers or one technology may not fit all customers. Some might want to use IGBT, some might want to go for silicon carbide or uh, CoolMOS. So what does this mean for Infineon? So at Infineon, we have best-in-class IGBT technologies, also best-in-class CoolMOS superjunction technology, and uh, of course, best-in-class also CoolSec technology, which we began introducing in last year's PCIM. And uh, with this, the customer can really pick what they want rather than choose what we have. So let's look at uh, uh, the application in detail. For example, this is a bi-directional uh, onboard charger uh, circuit. So here we make use of Infineon's 10 stop 5 fast switching IGBT in combination with the CoolSec uh, sh short key diode, which enables you to gain roughly 0.5 percentage point in terms of efficiency compared to a complete IGBT solution. Similarly, we have here a Vienna uh, topology built out of CoolMOS, which is again a very efficient solution. And uh, what you can see here is a totem pole power factor correction circuit. So power factor correction circuit is that part of the onboard charger which is uh, typically making sure that we meet the grid regulations. For example, the input voltage and the current, they have to always be in phase as much as possible and the power factor correction circuit makes sure of that. So let us look a little more into detail into this uh, totem pole uh, power factor correction circuit. So this is a very commonly used uh, topology in the market today. So this has uh, two phase legs. One on the left is switching at a higher switching frequency, typically around 85 kilohertz. And the second one is switching at uh, uh, line frequency, 50 hertz. So this is where most of the switching losses occur. And we replaced or we inserted silicon carbide uh, uh, MOSFETs here and uh, with this we see a significant uh, reduction in the switching losses and also a major gain in the efficiency. So here we try to compare the efficiency performance of a complete IGBT solution versus a complete uh, silicon carbide solution and on the Y axis you can see the efficiency and on the X axis you can see the output power load and uh, the blue curve uh, represents the full silicon uh, solution compared to the six solution in uh, brown. And the uh, six solution, as you can see, achieves uh, up to 98.9 .9 peak efficiency. And there is an improvement of roughly one percentage point uh, from the complete IGBT solution, which uh, is a clear confirmation that silicon carbide solutions enable significant higher efficiency in onboard charger applications. Mm -hmm.